my dad got me into golf when I was younger, when I was about three. It was called Tiny Tigers Lessons, so it's like tons of three and four year olds. I just gradually started playing and then joined the Ladies Golf Club at Trim when I was eight. From that I progressed on to playing the HSBC We Wonders, played in the US Kids European Championships and then from then obviously got into playing for Scotland when I was 13 and just been a part of that set up ever since. The university has helped me develop a lot, especially in my golf. Being up here and you're almost like, I just love how when you come up to the golf centre, you're almost guaranteed there's going to be somebody there. One of my probably weaknesses is my short game. So I'm going to find someone in the team who has a strength of short game and just play wee mini competitions against them. And that's what I've done over the past year that I've been at university and looking at my stats, it's improved so much. At the University of Australia, my coach is Dean Robertson and it's great to have him here as the head coach because obviously he's been a previous European Tour player and he's bringing a lot of different skills and knowledge, bouncing ideas off of him and getting him to help me. Having him there, helping me every single day on short game and long game as well, it's just helped me so much. You want to have good grades, play good golf and also have a slight bit of a social life on the side of that. So. It's not the easiest at all. You've got to you know, take all your work to events with you. You've just got to make sure that you leave even just an hour a day or something just to read over notes or like, like write a hundred words in an essay, just something just to keep you up to date with work. Um, you just got to try and manage your time and keep yourself organized and always be ahead of the game and know what you've got, what deadlines you've got coming up so that you're able to plan your time best. <laughs> I'd say the best bit about being part of the Women's Students Programme is having the academic flexibility within uni so you can obviously ask for extensions and different things like that and also the fact that the financial side of things is enabling me to play in the top elite amateur events, it's enabling me to play in more events each year, travel further afield in different places so that I can compete against the top European players which is helping my development for the future. I'm definitely leaning towards golf as being a long-term career goal. I'm going to get myself to the right level, get a degree um, and then give it a go because why not? It's, I absolutely love the game. <laughs>